Hi, I'm Sergio, Sergio Mercado Design, and welcome to the apartment I designed in Battery Park City. This is a two-story townhouse with one of the best views in the city. I have a lot to show you, so come, let's get started. In this apartment, I wanted to take advantage of every opportunity to express my design. Here in the entry, we built in the door frames and had them taped in so that when the doors are closed, it's a nice, smooth, flush look. For the furnishings in this space, we chose a beautiful carved stone bench. The mirror is metal and it's wrapped in suede and the light fixture is ceramic and we sourced it from Spain. I really love mixing materials. Let me show you how this plays out in the rest of the apartment. This is the main living area of the townhouse and it consists of the kitchen, dining room, and living room area. I like using warm whites and neutral tones for my interiors, including this rug I designed that's alpaca and leather in a warm oatmeal color. And that carries on to the window seat. This is the key feature in the living room. With this amazing view of the Hudson River, it's the place you really wanna sit, curl up, and get comfortable. And to give this a luxurious feel, we covered all the cushions and pillows in alpaca and cashmere. And to make this practical, we built in drawers underneath because the two things my client requested was comfort and storage. Just the way we recessed the doors in the entryway, we also recessed the television in the living room. I played with this idea through the rest of the apartment. Instead of using a base or a crown, we used a reveal detail to give the impression that the walls are floating. Being that this is an open plan, I wanted to integrate the kitchen into the living space. So the way I achieved this was by integrating all of the handles in the cabinetry, and I paneled all the appliances and extending the cabinetry into the dining area, giving the whole space a uniform feel. For the island, I wanted to feel more like a workspace. I sourced a calicata tucci, which we also used as the backsplash, and then paired it with these really comfortable bar stools. And for more formal dining, I sourced this beautiful walnut table with a same fume finish as the floors, paired it with these swivel chairs and a gilded bronze light fixture. I placed the dining table to take full advantage of this amazing view. Now let me take you upstairs to the private spaces of this apartment. From the moment I saw this staircase, I envisioned a double height linear light in the corner of this room. We then repeated it in the handrail and it created such an interesting geometry within the space. On the second floor, we have two bedrooms, one for my client's daughter and the master bedroom. The design challenge for this room was my client wanted a walk-in closet when there wasn't one. So the way I resolved this was to build out the entire room much like you would experience in a luxury ship. Every single elevation is filled with storage. To make the room feel extra cozy, we recessed the bed and the nightstands in special niches on either side of the bed with lighting. And again, to capture this amazing view, we built in another window seat. A little design tip, if you wanna make a space feel more grand, use one material on all the surfaces, just like I did in the master bathroom. I've really enjoyed showing you my work, and I hope you've seen, through my use of details, textures, and tones, I made this home both comfortable and stylish. Thanks for watching. Like what you see on the show? Well, be sure to subscribe to our channel. We have so many more beautiful homes to share.